Welcome everyone to the card kit reveal and inspiration for our card kit called Look for the Rainbows. This is Sherry Carroll for Simon Says Stamp and I'm going to do a quick walkthrough of the beautiful contents of this card kit. First up we have the 6x8 stamp set Look for the Rainbows and this has some really beautiful messages and also some gorgeous flowers that you can put together to create your own bouquet. Towards the bottom there are some sweet birds that you can also add to your flowers along with a little butterfly. There are plenty of elements to put together to create some beautiful cards. We have also included something really special and this is the Tim Holtz Kaleidoscope 3D Texture Fade and it's an embossing folder so you can emboss your papers with some great texture. If you like embellishments, we have two sets for this kit. This first one is Nouveau Crystal Gems, and these are highly reflective in a rainbow color in a variety of sizes. You will also receive the American Crafts Smelly Box of Crayons Enamel Dots, and there are several different shapes, so you get hearts, stars, and dots, and there are 45 pieces all together in this pack to use on your cards. Our pattern papers this month come from Vicki Booten and they are 6x8 double sided papers and you get 12 in all. I'll flip through these so you can see what is on both sides. There are some great bold flowers, black and whites, and also some really fun dots, also a nice cloudy version, some darker colors and also some rainbow stripes, some florals, cameras, diamond patterns, also some hearts and polka dots and a great leaf background, rainbow patterns, also some lights and um, a really cute one with some birds on the bottom, and really great background ones and also ones that you can cut out and just add to your card as an individual panel. So those are six inch by eight inch papers, double sided and you get 12 sheets. Another fun element that we've added to this kit is the Tim Holtz Ideology 8x8 metallic craft cardstocks. These are great and don't forget to use those with your embossing folder. They are really beautiful. The envelopes this month are Schoolhouse Red and that is metallic. Also metallic Audrey Blue and then finally Island Blue envelopes and those do have that peel and stick for all those envelopes so that you don't have to lick them to stick them. And finally, we have four 8.5 by 11 cardstocks, and that is Island Blue, Audrey Blue, Schoolhouse Red, and 120 pound white cardstock from Simon Says Stamp. So, this is our Look for the Rainbows card kit available now. Our designers were really busy creating some beautiful cards. This first one is by Jessica Frost Ballas, and she used some watercolor pens to color in those blossoms, and finally, with a message at the bottom. Cindy Norberg created this really fun card using that embossing folder and pulled together all the same colors for a really cute card. Heather Hoffman used the rainbow paper with an embossed message on some vellum where she cut it out in a banner and stitched it to her card and then she finished it off with some of those heart-shaped enamel dots. Crystal Thompson created her card by using some of that metallic cardstock and then watercolored her flowers in a nice arrangement on top. I hope you've enjoyed our walkthrough and inspiration ideas for the reveal of our card kit Look for the Rainbows. Be sure to check out our blog post and galleries for additional inspiration. And as always, thanks so much for watching.